Hey guys, it's Whopper here, and today I'm going to be opening the It Seems Perfect and then the Backyard Play sets from our generation. I did get these for Christmas, but I wanted to open them in a separate video, so that video didn't get too long. So, I'm going to start off with this one. I'm going to try to make this quick, so you guys don't have to watch me struggle for too long. that so first thing I guess comes with a little ping pong right now is that what this is called I'm not very good at these but it's one of the, yeah those things so it also comes with a little frisbee with a little heart design on it um, little ice cream jump rope that is tied together. Oh, sorry, did you? Oh, I think this is what this is. I'm pretty sure this is a little jump rope. I don't know. I don't know how to undo this. And then also comes with a little smiley face, squishy, bouncy ball. A lot more ye okay. Very yellow. Comes with a little set of jacks, I believe is what these are called. I've never actually played this before, so I don't know how you play, but I guess it comes with a ball. So I'm just gonna set these in there. Okay, so there's that set. That's all back in here. Okay, now on to the It Seems Perfect. I'm very excited to open this. So let me figure this out. instructions just says slide the button under this okay I'll figure that out later So the first thing is this little 
measuring tape rope. I believe this is in centimeters and then the sides in inches. I don't think it's accurate. It might be. I'm really bad at telling that kind of stuff. Okay, so the first thing is a pattern, I believe, not positive, okay yeah, this is just a pattern to make, I assume the dress that is on the box, and then, oh this is a little bag for the pattern to go in, this is so cute, that was very creative of them. So now it's like an actual sewing pattern you can buy at the store. Comes with a little bit of uh, little sewing scissors that open and close. So cute. Um, comes with a little itty bitty ruler. It's adorable. Um, a fabric pen is what I'm guessing this is. And then two spools of thread in pink and white. Ooh. And that's just garbage. Okay. So there's a there's those there, there's a there. there are those. <laughs> then here's a little fabric that comes with it. So if you want, you can make that dress in the packaging. I'm gonna leave this like this, just because it makes a good prop for videos and other stuff. Okay, and then also come comes. With this little sewing box thing, I guess, with a little sewing graphic on it, just pink and empty, but it also comes with um, a thimble, some buttons, and I don't know what that green thing is, I want to say something to measure with, I recognize it, but I don't remember what it's called really, I don't want to say what it is because I don't know for sure if that's what it is. So I'm just going to open this and I believe this goes in here just so we don't lose it. So, oh, there's four buttons. Okay. Okay, and then also there's a little um, pin cushion that you can put on your doll's wrist and use that. So I'm going to see if everything can fit, everything small like can fit into here, the scissors can, can the ruler, yes it can, the fabric pen, the two, the two spools of thread can fit in there as well, the little pin cushion, and then the pattern cannot because it's square, it's a little bit bigger, but I'm going to see if the measuring tape can. I'm going to fold it a little bit differently. Okay, yeah, it can fit everything inside with not that much extra room, but a little bit of extra room, which is very nice. So, before we get to the actual sewing machine, there's this plastic, I want to say the mannequin, but I don't think that's what you call it. And it just goes, well, this is, this is really heavy. Does it spin? Oh, guys, it, it, it spins, and I believe there's a little bit of dirt on that. You just pop this in. Yep, just pop it in and look, it spins. Which is so nice. It says La Belle Mod. I don't want to say that. I'm pretty sure I'm going to pronounce it wrong. And then it also says uh, Hold, Hold, I don't know, Couture 1927. And then the little chair, this thing is tiny. It could fit Olivia better than I think it could fit an actual American Girl doll. Olivia's my small doll, it's like a Welly Wisher if you don't know. Very cute. I'm gonna be cutting off the tag because that's kind of annoying. It's very squishy. And then finally, oh whoa, this I thought the sewing machine was connected. It's not. Here's the table. Very cute. You can use it as a nice stand if you wanted. Okay, so a little button. Whoa. Okay, so you just do that to make 
to stay if you didn't see and then you just pop the little sewing machine in here if you didn't see that okay how do you get it to stay back okay okay there's a little button right here this that pops out and then you just fold this up and over and then finally there's a little sewing machine has different types of stitching and if you look carefully it is moving up and down nothing moves when you turn this this is for the thread i wonder if it could actually fit on that why don't we check and this is where the Ooh. sewing machine goes just right in here it's very nicely so I wonder if the thread can actually fit no it cannot I believe that's where the thread goes I haven't actually watched someone sew in a while so but this does the chair does fit underneath it perfectly it's very nice you could use it don't have to use it as a sewing thing machine you can use it as something else I'm just gonna pop this back and then also to get this to go back, you just think you have to move the button and then do it. Yeah, it just takes a little bit of trust. I really wish this opened, but it doesn't because that's where the sewing machine goes. I don't know how to get this to stop shooting out. Let me know if you know, because if I keep doing this, it would shoot out. But very cute set. Everything can pack away quite nicely and I wonder if you could no you couldn't but you could set this here and do this if you're worried about storage and you could set this on top here because I'm always worried about storage for my stuff so yeah you could just do that if you don't have that much space so yeah thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next video Bye.